Hello everybody, Sean Fallon, Your Games in Review. We're back with the second half of the Let's Play. Uh, sorry it took us a while to get the second half up. We were having problems using different TVs, trying to get better sight on the screen, stuff like that. Uh, right, you'll be seeing this on Thursday, because Wednesday, the day that we're recording all this, uh, YouTube and Google and a lot of places are protesting the SOPA. And, out of respect for everybody's protests, we're holding off on releasing this until tomorrow. Not that a lot of people are watching my videos, but so it really don't matter, but we feel out of respect for everybody who's trying their hardest to stop SOPA. We're gonna we decide to hold off until today, the day that you're watching it, Thursday, to actually release the recordings of the second hand for Let's Play. So, it's me and my brother again, and we're going to get right back into this. Uh, our voices will probably be friggin' a little bit less hearable, because we're going to be a bit further back from the screen than we were last time. Or at least I will be. My brother was just sitting in the same spot he was last time, so. But, anyway. Uh, right, so... When we left off, left off we learned about the... <coughs> Sorry. When we last left off, we learned about the... No, not the Chocobo Lina. We learned about the, uh, the Monster Souls. I decided to go back to Chocobo Lina because I noticed how much uh, money I had. Uh, I wanted to buy a weapon. The you want to take down. Then take a look around. And she apparently loves to rhyme. I can rhyme all day, in every way, all the time. I love to rhyme. And then orange. <laughs> Don't be a douche. <laughs> Hippopotamus. 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 I'm so hip. Hippopotamus. That was just a uh, That was terrible. No more fun. Can you explain what you're buying? You know I'm right, I bought a weapon Everybody's for Sara and. A couple of things for me to show you how the crystallarium works. Uh, so first, I'm gonna equip the. For this game, uh, each of the equipments has something to do with the crystallarium. So some of the weapons increase the amount of crystallarium pieces you can have. Some of them less. I don't know exactly how it fully goes because they don't really explain a lot of stuff to you in this demo. Well, I, at least on the part of the crystal area. They kind of hope that you're smart enough to know, uh, have played the game before to know how the crystal area works. The only big difference is for the monsters, which I'll get to after I go through Sarah's and figure out what to give each of them. So for Sarah, I'm going to Ravenger because she has a, a skill she can learn right away. Uh, this crystal area thing isn't going to work. Yeah, I, I, I realize that it's very right back onto it. So, uh, I increased Sara's Ravenger because she learned Lightning Strike and uh, Noel's Commando because he learned the Blind Side, which increases the. Uh, uh, you know, don't, don't even bother with it it's, if it's not going to work. Alright, the Crystallarium with the monsters, uh, each monster. It's a normal crystallarium. There's only one pass since they're all broken down into medics and sentinels and commandos and all these other ones. So they only have one crystallarium path. But the thing with the crystallarium path is you have to buy items. Uh, for animal types, it's potent droplet, which helps you increase their crystallarium design. So right now, I'll, since these are the only two I have, I'll increase this one by three. I bought three for each. Um, and for the robot types, which the uh, Zerig Scanroid is, uh, you need potent bolts. For and other types, you, you can find uh, potent bolts and uh, potent drops. Potent bolts, potent drops, and um, magic bolts and magic drops in this demo. Magic bolts are actually a lot harder to find than magic drops. Okay, so that's all done. Yeah, it's, uh, also it's in the shape of the monster. 
So depending on the size of the monster and stuff like that, it can have a larger crystallarium, stuff like that, depending on its type too. Wow. So on to the ruins. Wait, so what we we'll look at? Koala is some decent to look at them on Final Fantasy XIII. Yeah, it, 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 it's a lot easier to figure out than Final Fantasy XIII. Also. Holy! Harder, everybody! Because it's a giant big hand. I thought we went over this last time. Oh yeah, th this is a very good thing. When you're actually in battle, you can attack the monster first. Like, see that time I wasn't able to hit him. But you can attack the monster first when it appears in order to try and uh, <clears throat> get a get a advanced strike on I got a uh, early move as a new monster. Uh, I think that's a, and a potent droplet. So let's add early move in my paradigm path, which I think is a dog. Which yep, he's commando and a, a dog looking thing. Uh, so let's go with triple commando. Starburst. Ah. They're funny because it's a dog. Ah, 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 ah. You're so funny. Stop my line. Let's see, progression. So now we have each of the monsters. We have one for each of them. Like I said last time, I, I really like the, uh, the robot monsters. The robot monsters that you get better. They're a, bit, uh, they're a bit stronger than the, the animal types. I mean, I'm sure there's, like, when you find a, if you're able to, like, get a behemoth or something like that, I'm sure that's a lot stronger than any, than most of the robot types. Right. Key is something that doesn't belong in this I think I found the key. Just a hunt. I think I found the thing that doesn't belong in this time. You mean that? What's your press is good, sir. You lost steroids. An enhancement substance. An oral steroid? It's not the weirdest thing to solve this boss. Apparently in uh, Night Sail the Public they lost the vaccine to an incurable disease. How do you lose the vaccine to an incurable disease? Alright, well, looks like that's about my nine minute mark. Uh, this guy wants you to find a seat. If anyone played the old game, seat or foul sea. Uh, foul sea, the, the servants of the lessee who have failed in their objective given to them by the Lussie. And there shouldn't be any fallacy because all the Lussie are gone. So a paradox happened. That's one of the paradox keys that you have to... You get a paradox key from the fallacy, but you don't really get to use it. Alright, so we'll be back in just a few seconds.